So, instead of my usual, I, I literally just make Instagram reels and shorts uh, with music playing there, I thought I'd actually do a video where I'm talking. Um, and I just want to talk about the double M bag for anyone who can't hang a heavy bag at home or has a heavy bag actually, I would say get this as well. Because um, these are really great for, the, they're a moving target so as you hit them it will actually move and get you used to tracking, get used to missing as well. Because you're not going to land every shot so you can miss and then you still have to follow through. It'll get you used to throwing maybe six shots and having five from land, missing the one in the middle and still still being upright and still going. Um, yeah, the reason, main reason I wanted to make this is I saw a little short the other day. Um, it was a lad, he had boxing gloves on, hitting, hitting one of those, uh, he had the, head, the headband with the string and the tennis ball. I've never had one of them. Um, I've, I've seen videos of, you know, high level kickboxers and everything using them. So, I'm not knocking them, but I just think if you're a beginner uh, and you need something you can practice basic stuff on, I would recommend one of these more. Um, I've literally got this. This is just a uh, pull-up bar that was, I got off Amazon. It was about 15 quid. Um, double M bag itself. I've, this is a, I've, one I've had for years. I can't remember much, but they go for at most a tenner. Ten pounds live in the UK. They go for at most a tenner, and I've seen people make them with footballs or soccer balls if you don't live in if you live anywhere else in the world. Um, and literally just get the bungee and they just tape them and affix them all. It's on tight. Um, if you're a beginner. You don't have to boom, 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 land every shot, hit it, get it moving quick. You can just drill simple, basic combos. Um, one that my coach always loves to get us to drill is a cross, a hook, and a cross. You can just boom, 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 drill it over and over. If you're into kickboxing, okay, you can't really kick this. But what you can do is you can practice setting up your kicks. So say if you want your jab entry, to come over to your round kick, you can still drill that. Um, one thing a lot of people, even with the heavy bag, they don't understand is that you can miss the bag. That's fine. Say if you're the heavy bag, particularly with uppercuts, people always try to do this, eh? Which isn't wrong. That's a thing. But you can also just throw a tight uppercut at the air and let your shadow box in. Same with this, if you want to land body shots, you want to practice your double hook combination, just hit the rope. Hit the rope, come up. You don't need gloves for these, you can hit them with gloves. Um, I was putting this with gloves before, just because I hung this from a tree a while back and I scuffed up all the leather and it was cutting my hands a little bit. But, yeah. Any home workouts, get one of these, get creative with them, you can even hang them up to horizontal. Um, I've done that before, I've, I've, I found it off YouTube, it was a revolution to me at the time. But hang it up horizontal and you can do your rope drill off it, do your rope drill, still having something to hit. Um, anyone sign out, I hope this helps. Um, because I know a lot of people can't hang heavy bags up. Maybe they're renting. Maybe it's too much noise. These, this is relatively quiet if you've not got the, the dog running around like I have. He's locked out at the minute because every time he sees this, he starts going off. But, yeah, just, you can just get one of these and play with it. Practice just getting your jab, bump, 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 bump. Do that, uh, I can't remember what that's called. It's, you don't really do it when you're boxing, but there's a drill that people like, like just throw it as fast as you can. 
What else? Anything else with these? No, I am not good at talking in videos, so let's just chuck this one to practice. And I'll make some more at some other point. a really good bag to practice elbows because you can actually cut through with the um, the sharp bit of your bone. When you're hitting the heavy bag you kind of hit with the uh, end of it with the forearm just because if you're slicing across it kind of cuts your, cuts your arm up because it's not the same as a person's head. But this on the other hand you can Set up your elbows, line up your elbows, you can way better than a heavy bag. Spinning stuff as well. Not went to the doorway, but it's a pretty decent bag to practice. Bump. If you do it on the heavy bag, you kind of gotta sink into it. You can do that and then you can't pass through the bag with this on the other hand. Let's do it for yourself one. You can kind of go right through it. Like you supposed to. So, elbows, like I say you can't really kick it. I have spent time when well, I've got it in an open space and kicking this. Um, that's more just for fun. It's no actual real practice. Well, probably is from someone out there who's gone, well, I learned to kick from doing that. It's made me amazing. workout tip there buy one of these also buy one of these and oh, okay yeah can't lift that like that well I can also get one of these because uh, well I think that pretty much covers which you can do a lot of strength training you can do also strength training and you can do a lot of technical training when you can't get to the gym or, oh, like me, just being really bored to go to the gym. And like I say, they're really cheap to replace, so you can absolutely batter the hell out of them. I'm going to fix them up. 